Hello darlings and welcome to Old Lady Bangers. My name is Michelle. I'm here to experience some cool music. I consume a lot of media. I'm a huge movie buff. I watch a ton of TV. I'm an avid reader. Uh, but for some reason I missed out on a ton of the most recent music. I find myself driving in my car, listening to the same music from my childhood over and over again on my phone just because it happens to be there and easy to find. Um, and I know for a fact, because I started this channel a couple of weeks ago, I'm definitely missing out on some cool stuff. There are some good songs here I should be listening to. So let's dive into some music that I wouldn't normally find um, playing on the radio stations I listen to. Hopefully, as my music education goes on, we will have, as Kendall Roy says, all bangers all the time. Uh, but it's entirely possible that I won't be into it. And if that happens, I'll share that with you guys too. And you guys can suggest something else. I will never write off an artist just based on one song or one, de depending on what style of genre music it is. Like, I don't care about any of that kind of stuff. So to get started, I've been looking at the Billboard Top 100, focusing on the top 10 at any given time. Although since I started my channel three weeks ago, the top 10 hasn't changed that much. Um, I know that that's not always the best indicator of what the top music really is. So I'd love to hear from you about what you guys are listening to. But it's funny because I look through these lists and I realize like, I don't know any of these songs, which is, it's so weird to me because as a kid, the Billboard charts were everything. That was all basically the, all of the music that everybody listened to. That wasn't all segmented off like this. Um, and I barely know any of the artists anymore. So we definitely need to change that. So song number 14 on the Billboard charts is I'm Good Blue in parentheses by David Guetta and Bibi Rexha. I think I'm pronouncing her name right, Rexha. Um, again, you know, we're seeing this music producer listed before the actual artist who is singing the song, which I find that very confusing. Like I, I understand what music producers and DJs do. I just can't figure out why this song is now listed as a song by him as an artist, not as by BB Rexa. Um, so, you know, I go into this a bit more on my Bizarap and Shakira reaction earlier this week. Um, so if you can explain how this is a thing or why it's a thing, let me know. But either way, it doesn't really matter. I, I don't know any either of these artists. I haven't reacted to them on the channel before. So let's see what they've got for us. It, it, how they're listed on the thing doesn't really matter to me if the song is good, right? <laughs> so let's check it out. Play. Ooh, pretty. So captions unavailable. Is she speaking? Is she singing English? Okay, so there's something in modern music that I don't like that happens to be in this song. It's like this like weird like uh, 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 sound that's in like cl that club dance rhythm. I hate that sound. <laughs> I mean, it's a shame because I, I like this song and I like her, like she's very cool. I, the video's fun. Like I'm always good for, you know, for like a good, you know, glass onion type luxury white lotus kind of experience in my music videos i don't i don't mind that um and i very much like her eye her cat eye makeup um but yeah we'll see I, like it's good that too. and that's scratchy yeah look her eye makeup is very cool What the heck? <laughs> Who is this video for? Like, who is this song for? Like, I feel like this is made for teenage boys. Like, look at this sexy ass. Like, 
what? I'm sorry, I have to call that out. <laughs> and I like the song. Like, there's nothing wrong with this with the lyrics. But I don't know. From female artists, I expect something a little bit different. I'll just say it that way. Hmm. The concert parts of the video, I'm, I'm actually, you know, this this kind of like there, there she's dancing and singing and they're dancing and singing together is cool. Uh, but yeah, that party, say like with all the sexy girls in the bikinis, like uh, it's not really my thing. Okay, I mean, I'm all for being sexy. Like I have no problem if she wants to be sexy and show skin and stuff. But uh, there's a there's a point where it becomes more for the male gaze than about her and what she's thinking about. Yes. Yeah, so do we have like David Guetta to blame for that like wah, wah, uh, 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 rhythm, that weird kind of pulsing? I don't like that. I find it very unpleasant to listen to. <laughs> and maybe that's the thing. Like, I know I'm not necessarily the intended audience. Um, yeah. Like I, I liked the song. I thought it had a good, a good beat and a good rhythm. Um, it didn't. I think it could have been a little bit deeper, like, okay, you're having a good time. That's fine, I guess. Like, does, are her other, you guys who know her, like, are her other songs a little bit deeper, <laughs> more interesting? Like, does she have anything else to say about that? Um, yeah, so no, I wouldn't have, I'm not going to be downloading this one. It's not a banger, for me anyway, um, because I don't like that pulsing sound. I hate that sound. Um, so I won't be singing along to it in the car. I want to see more from her, more of her stuff though, because I like her voice and I like her style. Um, I definitely did not like the video, <laughs> but I, I won't hold that against her. I like her and I want to, she's definitely on the list of, of artists that I want to do more on the channel because I think she's got a really cool voice. So yeah. Sorry if you if you love this song and, and you're all like David, a huge David Guetta fan or something, but yeah. Again, I'm not understanding why his name is first on that and not hers. Let me say it that way. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. Hit the subscribe button to see more of my music reactions. And if you'd like to see movie reactions, including the entire Marvel Cinematic Universe and uh, what did I do recently? Oh, The Mummy, Ta uh, Terminator, Robocop. Have you seen that one? Oh my God. Yeah. But anyway, there's a link downstairs for you so you can find that easily. Leave your suggestions and comments below about what music I should be listening to, reacting to. I'm, I'm very interested in hearing what you guys want to hear more of. So I hope you'll join me in getting out of your comfort zone when it comes to the media you consume in support. You guys are awesome. I love you, darlings. Mwah.